Hello everyone, this is Inayat Meer. Back in video number 4, we have seen uh, 3 videos before. We configured 2 JSON files. So, this is a third JSON file containers.json or JSON. In this file, we are going to import the image from S3 bucket into EC2 console as AMI or Amazon machine image. Then we will provision a new EC2 instance that will be accessed through RDP or we can connect through the console. So, uh, that is the end goal. So, let us continue and move on with this containers.json file. So, first you have to copy. So, you have all these links given to you under the description of this video. So, let us copy that one uh, and make a new notepad plus plus file where we paste the contents of this JSON file. So, as you know that my S3 bucket name is RM11377, but we need to get S3 key. So, S3 key is under the uh, properties of your image. So, here I basically uh, have image in my S3 bucket and this is the key. So, when you double click on the image, you will see the bucket. So, this is a unique key for every image you export into your S3 bucket. So, I am going to replace the default given name to the image key what I have. So, now you can save this back. Uh, my server OVA is a description. Uh, we can change this one. I will come back and change back to this one as well j just to show you what I have in my uh, calling command. So, I am going to go and show you that one. First, you save under same location where we have a role.policy and trust.policy files. Uh, before in previous three videos, we have saved those files and used those two files. That is where my image also resides. So, now I am saving this third file. So, uh, here we have basically the command which we are going to use. Uh, we are uh, basically using these all commands actually. So, uh, I will make a clean final version of this command. So, containers.json we saved under our root drive c colon backslash a w s dash o v a. So, here I can change back my description uh, matching with my command what I am having under my uh, notepad and also you have these commands under your description and also I am going to add these commands under my Dropbox. So, now you can import the image from your S3 bucket and file is under your uh, root drive under AWS dash OVA to your AWS console as an AMI or Amazon machine image. So, here first uh, let me explain to you uh, at the very beginning when we had first video, we had a region and region name was misspelled and I told you that uh, I will come back later on and uh, will modify the region name. So, region name was wrong. So, because of that, uh, this command is taking long to get a result and it will not basically go through because we have a wrong region name. So, there is a way to change the region or region name and I am going to show you how. So, now currently as uh, expected, you can see that my region uh, is not uh, US West E, it is actually uh, 2 or US West 2 I believe. So, let us go and change it from here. Uh, actually, I can change at the back end as well and pause the video. So, let us see what we have now. Uh, now, we have dash E here you can type again AWS configure and you can add your key ID and access key. Now, after colon you can add 
us west dash 2 and now it is changed now you tap type again aws configure you will see the correct region so this is the region what we are looking for or or what we were looking for now you have to hit up arrow key and hit enter so what it gonna do here it will go and read the correct region now we have a right region this is our unique import ami uh, task id so uh, you are going to use this task id when you monitor here so you can monitor import tasks so import tasks this is uh, a list of the stuff what we are going through now so we are here uh, in pending state right now then we're gonna go through all of the other states and we will eventually gonna go into uh, completed state so that is where we will be able to see our image so here is the monitoring command with with a default import dash ami id which we are going to replace and change with our own id so let's go and take a look here and i'm going to mention here uh, what this command is so this command is to monitor your export image from your AWS S3 bucket which is a kind of storage into your EC2 console not as an EC2 instance it will be exported as uh, AMI image Amazon machine image from Amazon machine image we are going to provision an EC2 instance so here I copied my AMI ID or task ID like import task ID I am going to replace exactly what I have in my output command so that is my import task ID so this is correct now so now we can monitor what's going on at the back end so now you can see our ID is matching now I can copy this command and paste into my command line so now we will see where we are uh, that's how we monitor the export image from s3 bucket to amazon console so here now we are in converting stage so we went through pretty much or pretty far uh, ahead uh, now we have to uh, basically uh, wait for com converting and completing so completed uh, option so let's go to video number five to see these all other options thank you